Hi, uh, my name's Daniel. Um, I've just been asked to make this short video uh, just to share with you some of my experiences from my trip to Hong Kong last summer. So I entered a competition with the um, Hong Kong um, e-copping and trade office. I was lucky enough to be successful um, and then sort of visited uh, Hong Kong on, in the summer. I did a uh, summer school at the University of Hong Kong um, in the Faculty of Arts. It's a summer institute in the arts and humanities. Really, really exceptional course, really good quality as well, uh, especially the age group it was aimed at. Um, I was the only Western student in a cohort of um, local students from Hong Kong uh, around my age, age group, which is nice. Um, they mixed me very well with them. Lectures covered were topics such as traditional Chinese world order to languages. Really, really varied program. Um, so yeah, so I stayed for 18 days. The program was five. So I um, stayed quite a lot longer to explore. So some of the students that were on the program took me around, uh, which was lovely. Yeah, so Chung Chow Island. Um, lovely place, really traditional with lots of temples and more traditional sites, so traditional fishing island. And that was an excellent experience to uh, experience that more sort of non-touristy areas. Had some great food there and that was really nice. So one of my favourite aspects of Hong Kong was the views. So seeing them from the avenue stars on Kowloon side to the peak, and then visiting uh, the giant Buddha on Lantau Island along the other sites there. Um, Moi Wo, which is a really nice place um, which you should visit, not really necessarily on the tourist map, but a really excellent place. Another aspect uh, of the whole experience itself was the Friends for Life I made. Um, I still keep in contact with a lot of people in Hong Kong and um, the other, your fellow winners, uh, really will become uh, very good friends. Um, my, just a few top tips as well, um, is try all the things put in front of you, sort of don't be nervous with it. I think initially it was quite sceptical but then got stuck in and found lots of new uh, flavours and dishes I liked. Uh, and then, of course, the Octopus Car, which is a live family there for the convenience stores. Um, the MTR, buses, transport, really excellent. And uh, I've still got quite a lot of mail on mine because I forgot to buy all the uh, sweets and stuff. So I didn't do that, I don't leave quite a lot of mail on it. Mine's actually uh, here, I always carry around with me still. And it's uh, really, really was excellent. And um, yeah, the place is fantastic. Really must experience it for yourself. Uh, so you can read my essay online and my blog on the British Council website. I hope you enjoy reading those if you uh, if you have the time. I really, really encourage you to enter this uh, this year's competition. Only the second one. Um, I was obviously in the, in the first. Um, take, take the time with it. Um, you know, excellent experience if you win. Um, you know, don't be put off at all. Uh, going on your own is. You know, I found it really good experience to be honest. Um, develops you quite a lot. You keep in contact with the office, uh, especially on your return, and do things like this for them, which are really enjoyable. And um, yeah, good luck in the competition. I hope you are successful. And uh, yeah, hope to meet you if you are, and uh, maybe see you soon.